Hi, it's Alaska Granny. I recently made some manwich sauce with some ground beef in my crock pot and I have a little bit left over. So then I was thinking, how can I use this up? I want to make the most of the foods that I have in my prepper pantry, my food storage stockpile, and sometimes trying to think creatively helps you find a brand new meal. I have a few Knorr pasta sides, cheesy bacon flavored macaroni, which isn't something that I really care for. My sweetheart used to love it and I had it stockpiled for him and I would make meals for him and he enjoyed it, but he's passed on. So now I thought, well maybe I can make this, add in some manwich, and maybe it'll be delicious. So let's try it. I've got a pot on the stove with the water, milk, and butter to make the Knorr pasta sides, cheesy bacon flavored macaroni. Now I'm gonna pour in the package and cook it for 10 minutes like it says on the package. I like a lot of the Nora pasta sides but cheesy bacon flavor macaroni I just don't care for it because it's bacon flavored and bacon is just not one of my favorite flavors. That's why it's good to try different things. You never know what's going to be your favorite. You can see the macaroni is done. I let it sit a couple minutes for the sauce to thicken and now I'm going to add the manwich. So probably the beef and the manwich sauce will tone down the bacon flavor and maybe this will be super enjoyable. Okay, let's try it. That definitely makes it better. Is it going to be the best meal I ever had? Of course not. But lots of meals aren't going to be, and if you don't have some just ordinary meals, how are you going to know when something is exquisite? This is certainly a great way to serve the Knorr pasta sides bacon cheesy macaroni. It's much better in my opinion because I don't care for the bacon flavor. The manwich certainly covers it over, and now it's a quite handy nice meal. So if you do find that you have some foods that you're not really fond of and you're not really sure what to do with, try doing something crazy with them. Mix them up with something unusual. Think outside the box. We want to get the full value out of the foods we have in our prepper pantry and our food storage stockpile. So try combining things. You never know what can happen. Just look at peanut butter cups. Who would have thought? But somebody did. Maybe this will be the next big thing. Leave us a comment on what foods did you put together to rescue a food you really didn't care for that turned into something you quite liked. I hope you'll like my video, share my video, and please subscribe to the Alaska Granny channel.